Hey guys, so I'm bringing to you a requested video on my favorite lip products. I'm in love with lip stains, lipsticks, lip gloss, anything lips, especially now that I've gone curly. I feel like lashes and lips just looks amazing with curly hair. So before I get into that, I want to give you guys an update on a new um, highlighter that I, well it's not new, but a highlighter that I would suggest. Um, because in my everyday makeup tutorial, you guys always see that I use Albatross highlighter to give you that really pretty glow. Um, and now, actually, I came across this one from MAC. It's called Carefree. It's really similar to Albatross, but it's more gold. So, if you're more of that deeper tone skin, this actually will look amazing on you, believe it or not. So Carefree from MAC, you guys, a really great highlighter. I even wear it myself, but it also will look great on deeper tones because I know a lot of people asked about that. So great, there's a new one for you. So moving on to lips. Right now, I have on um, NYX's Matte Lipstick. This is actually my favorite pink lipstick. It's called Sweet Pink. And y'all have had this for a while because last year I was in the NYX Face Awards as well as this year. And this is one of the colors that they gave as gratis um, for being in the NYX Face Awards for one of the challenges. So I've been in love with it ever since. So obviously it lasts a long time. So besides that I'm going into some more NYX lip colors because NYX is great because you get a pretty good quality for a really nice cheap price um, they also have these lip creams which are pretty cool so the the stay matte lip cream is a little bit more hydrating than this lipstick I'm wearing now this color is called Addis Ababa I'll give it all the names in the description box at the end. This color is really similar to the one I have on. It's just that it's more of a cream hydrating finish if you like that. And then if you want that kind of liquid lipstick, their um, extreme lip creams are really great. Um, they're more glossy. They're more of that glossy finish. And they have all kinds of colors, guys. These are just some of my favorite pink ones. Um, Pinky Nude is great, and Dolly Girl is also a great pinky color. So I'll, again, I'll put the names in the description box. So I'm basically showing you guys all my greatly priced cheap favorites first, and then I'll show you my luxury, absolutely love favorite ones. So the Wet n Wild lipsticks are great. They are like $2, and it's great if you really want to see what lip color works for you. So you get to basically try on different colors. Like this one is the Bear It All Beige. So this is their nude color. And it's funny because their nude color on me looks a little different than it might look on you. So it's great that it's only $2. So you can really try it out to see what you, what colors look great on you. Personally, I love mauve colors. Um, kind of like a cooler neutral pink. Um, but yeah, try these out. Only $2. See what color works good on you. And then that way when you're able and you're ready to get those more luxurious brand lipsticks, you know what kind of colors go well with you. But regardless, one great thing again, guys, when you're going into like a department store or Sephora, you can try on the lip colors before you buy it versus with these ones, the cheap ones, you can't. So that's that's the exchange so and honestly sometimes it's fun to just go in those department stores and just try on lipsticks all day that's a great way also to find out what color works best with you my absolute favorite cheap everyday lipstick is the warm me up color from Maybelline I believe this is um, yes from Maybelline number 235 it's a great color because it just adds a little warmth to my lips and that's my favorite everyday cheap um, lipstick so moving along into the more pricier ones which are also amazing um, my favorite everyday lip stain you guys I'm obsessed with this I go through it like water that's why I've been trying to find a color that's similar to this I won't go through these so fast because I can only get these online or in San Francisco it's from the brand Craylon it's called gospel 
and it's a lip stain. This is, ugh, I love, I love it, I love it, I love it. It stays on all freaking day long, y'all. And it's the color is just amazing. I get so many compliments. Whenever I wear this color, people are like, what color are you wearing? What color are you wearing? I love your lipstick. Because it's enough color, but it's not too much. Perfect for every day, perfect for evening. It just is the this is the best color ever. And the closest thing I could find to it is from MAC because you know it's a little easier for me to get to versus going to San Francisco. I live in the East Bay, which is like 20 minutes plus to San Francisco. Um, anyhow, Mac Twig, Mac Twig is the closest I can get to Craylon Gospel. It's not the same because it's not a lip stain, but it's the closest I can get to it. Another great option if you really want like a nice matte look is to use um, the either a lip liner. This is my favorite one for Mac. Max Soar, like literally you can just put this all over your lips, call it a day, put a little clear gloss just in the middle of your lips and you're good to go. Soar by MAC is an amazing color. Um, and then Inglot has these jumbo crayon lip pencil thingies and they're great because you can line your lips really well and also fill in at the same time. This one and Soar are very similar in color. I will put the name of this Inglot one specifically, but these are great colors that you can wear every day and they give you just enough color to where it's not like you have a new lip, but you have that everyday great lip. <sighs> my dog is like trying to get my attention. Anyway, and lastly what I want to show you is my favorite gloss. Recently I've been sticking more to matte colors on my lips. Um, but when I do love a gloss, my favorite one is Ample Pink from MAC. I wore this gloss a lot in my older videos, my colorful eye tutorial. Like a lot of the ones where I had just a bold, bold eye. This is a great gloss just to pop on and gives you enough color without competing too much with your eye color. So again, y'all, those are my favorite lip brands, lipstick colors, um, but again, when you're finding the color that's right for you, it's all about going in and trying it on. Even if you guys don't want to purchase that day, don't let anybody force you at the department store or at Sephora. Just go in there, get you a lip wand, please clean, you guys clean off the lipsticks before you try it on, please. You don't know how many people put that on their lips without cleaning it. All you have to do is get some alcohol, wipe it off with tissue, get a lip wand, scrape it off and try on try as many lipsticks as you want go in with your friends have fun try on lipsticks that's really how you find out what works on you is trying it on then from there you can go into like drug stores and kind of know the color tone that works for you like for example again Maybelline warm me up my absolute favorite cheap drugstore brand everyday color so that's all, and I hope that was helpful. Again, it'll all be in the description box. Thanks for watching, you guys, and make sure you follow me on Instagram, okay, Twitter, everything. <laughs> Bye.